Hey, what's up, guys? Jack Studios here, and today we're with Zeus. How's your thought? Let me see. Oh, goodbye. My hair looks horrible too. Come on, come on, back up. No, don't get into that, Zeus. What are you doing? This dog. He's funny, but he he's a little mischievous. Zeus, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, Zeus. Oh, he's gonna he's gonna lay down there. Can you see his tail? Yeah, you can see his tail. Okay, so basically, what this video is about is it's gonna be a story time. But you can see. You can see that in the title, but it's going to be a story time about how me, my friend Jake, my friend Josh, best friend, best bros, BFFs, hashtag slay, no, not really, just, um, we, we had a, well, I don't know, I'll just describe this as arson, cops, Lady yelling and exploring the woods. So, um, a few, this is about, I think it was last, this is last year, but I was over at my friend Jake's house with my friend Josh for a sleepover, and me, Jake, and Josh, so Jake had seen these big forest fires, some guy, arsonist, they, su they suspect it was an arsonist, and this is in Florida, by the way, so I don't know if you guys have heard lately about all the wildfires that have been going on, but this was kind of like one of those big wildfires, and we went in there afterwards to, like, check it out and just see what it looked like, and this lady, we thought she was calling her dog, she was like, get back here, get back here now, and we were just walking around, right, and we go in there, and we're looking around, and there's a girl that lives in Jake's neighborhood that's friends with her brother, friends with his brother, and she texted his brother Tyler and said, "Get Jake and his friends out of the woods now because the neighborhood's calling the cops on, because they thought that we were committing arson." So, long story short, we got yelled at by this lady, and when she tried to make us tell her our ad when she tried to make us tell her our address, he told her. And they they live on this lake, so he told her the lake. He told her he lived across the lake. He told her his address, and she was like, "No, that's a bunch of BS." And then she was like, "The cops are on their way." So the cops were on their way. They came, and it was kind of funny because it was six o'clock when this happened. We went back. We forgot about it for the next three hours, and we were doing what we normally do on a sleepover. I'm sure this isn't normal. But we were loading up on food. Come on up, Zeus. Come on up, big boy. Come on up. Come on up. Oh, this, this dog doesn't. He likes fidget spinners, though. Watch this. Zeus. Look. 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 He likes it. No. I guess this isn't just... This is just for on camera. He's acting now. Come on up. Come on up. Oh, no. He, he does like them. See, the fidget spinner. You gotta give him motivation. Come on up. Come on up. Okay, so, back to the story. Um, basically what happened was we were, like, making dishes, diabetes in a pot, stuff like that. So basically you just, like, unload the whole whipped cream bottle into a pot, throw in a big tub of ice cream, put some syrup on it, and then, I don't know, throw a whole pack of Oreos and stuff like that. And we're playing video games, hanging out, building for stuff like that. Hitting each other with pillows. The. What we think is normal stuff. I mean I don't know about you guys. But about 10 o'clock. Someone knocks on the door. And his mom. We told Jake's mom all about this. And she was like. Oh honey it's the cops. They're finally here. So it was four hours ago. Four hours later. And the cop came. And we walked downstairs. And I guess he was expecting like. Some like teenagers. Because at the time I was 12. Or no. 
wait a minute, I was 11, so this happened two years ago. I was 11, Josh was 11, and Jake was 12. And we all came downstairs, and this cop was like, oh, I know you guys didn't do it. But the neighborhood, like half the neighborhood was all riled up about this. And uh, the cop was like, the cop just gave us like a talk about how we're allowed to go back there, but don't go back there because of the neighbors. But all in all, it was, it was pretty funny. It was pretty good. And it was just very like, it was very scary at first, but then it was like, you had to be there to understand it. It was cool though, like the firefighters, they dug like all these ditches and they put signs up for five grand for the, if you catch the person or have information leading up to the arrest. But this was two years ago, but it was kind of like all these wildfires happening now that are like all pew, 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 pew. So, I guess that's all I have. Um, thank you guys for watching and see you soon. Zussi, what you got to say to the camera? You got to say anything to the camera? Continue watching and see you soon in the next video. Drop a like, subscribe, comment, view this video. Wait, no, you clicked on it, you've already viewed it. Oh, that's all you want to say. Okay. So, like, comment, subscribe. Um, see you guys next time. I know I haven't really posted in a while, but I'm going to start trying to post as much as I can now that it's summer. And if you enjoyed, just, I don't know, for the third time, like, comment, subscribe, guys. Just smash that like button if you're going to like this video. And...